Hi, and welcome back to Let's Play Lama Lana. So we're heading back down into the bowels of the spring in the sky. Not really the bowels, but just the lower area. I don't know, I just want to say barrel bowels, so I don't know why. You don't get to say the bowels of the castle or anything like that too often. But yeah. There's no longer a lock on that little pedestal thing. And there also happens to be an Ankh in the background. A puzzle solved, yeah. Let's teleport back to the spring in the sky. And head back up. Maybe hit some stuff along the way. You know, why not? Here. Gotta check the pots for gold. Never have too much gold. Actually, I don't know how much gold you end up needing, but now we can buy a pistol. Not sure how useful it ends up being, but it's 100 gold. Can't afford that right now. I'm sure in the future we'll also need to buy more weights, because the game likes to be stingy with its weights. Platform and up we go. There's the fish shop. It's a fish, but it's a shop run by a fish. Which would actually make it the fish's shop, not the fish shop. Shop. Oh, come on. Damn it. I guess we're riding this platform one more time. I can't jump to save my life. Although jumping has been going better in this game than in many previously. Alright, we're gonna make it this time. Aha! Apparently I could have made it last time. Oh, really? Alright, right on the platform for a third time. Because I am... Uh, yeah. I suck at games, admittedly. Alright, made that. Hero miracle jump right there. Alright, we're on the platform. Fish is off the bottom of the screen. Not gonna bother us, hopefully. This one might try to, but he will miss horribly. Actually, the Ankh is revealed now. Just I wanna check first. Gonna reset again. I can make that jump anyway. The thing I want to check being there was that ladder up at the top of this area. Like in the top top where I couldn't get to. That could have been bad. I was taking a sip of water when the fish decided to attack. When fish attack. There's a broken ladder up there. I don't think we can jump up there. Nah. Alright. I do believe we have the Ankh Jewel. Yes, we do. Boss time! Here we go. If I can press the correct button, there we go. Yeah, we're on a boat. Oh. Oh boy. Oh dear god. It's the giant fish whose name I really just don't remember. Alright, it's Bahamut maybe? We, we killed Bahamut already. Oh, almost managed to dodge everything. That was like a miracle work right there. Hit him when we jump him up when he's off the waves. Sort of like 
that. And I'm gonna get hit again for like 20 damage. Not cool, man. Not cool. There's somebody close to the Really? Hit him once. As long as I can avoid getting hit by him, he should be okay. Not happen because of course I suck at games. And I walked into him. Can't teleport out, so I'm pretty much screwed. Alright, so round two, here we go. We're gonna start this recording a little later, so we can have to watch this cutscene. The assuming comet approaching, we could avoid it to watch that again. But I hit him twice, and I'm not gonna get hit by his little screaming eyeball things. Hopefully not gonna get hit when he just has to jump on my head. And I ran into him. I can't always not get hit. And sometimes you get hit by his screaming and stuff. Alright, so we're not doing that again, at the moment at least. Tried a second time, went equally as poorly as the first time. But now I do believe there are a couple things we can run around and grab that we have the... whatever the hell glyph we got. I really don't remember. Ah, there's also one other thing I want to do. Let's head back to the Spring in the Sky. We're gonna be coming right back to the Temple of the Sun, but from a different route. And there's a reason for that. Those fish have, like, penises that shoot lasers. Yeah. Yeah. Not sure why I went this way, the other way would have been quite a bit faster. Whatever. Ah. Yeah, there's like that suspicious tile right above me at the moment. And apparently I revealed a bunch of coins that I can't actually get to. What the hell? That sucked. Oh well. Anyway, down into the Temple of the Sun we go for a reason. Cause we have the helmet now. We can actually. Ch oh, there's no more water. What the hell? Oh, we didn't need the helmet anymore, apparently. What is in here? The goddess Isis is, the hat is at the Temple of the Sun. She gave birth to Horus and his figure of motherhood. Because of this fact, she awaits silently perched higher than any other god. Okay. I would 
this tablet. I was told to choose three women. They were... They are waiting at the promised location. I couldn't do it. They still yet... They yet still wait within the moon guising pit. To the one who reads this now, please pierce her heart in my stead, she who never lets her smile fade. Moon gazing. That was moon guising. Break that statue. And we can head this way. Now I believe. Aha! That area still hasn't opened up though. Ah great, dark area. dark, it's narrow. It's me, I believe. There should be a dark room with no light somewhere in the ruins. Yeah, I found it. There should be some places where you can light something. Maybe you can have a weapon on hand that you can light with those fires. Light those fires with. Let the light burn here. problem with recording a block of Let's Plays in sequence is the fact that when you're getting interrupted non-stop, you tend to continue getting interrupted non-stop. Dark room in here. Take the dragon bone in hand, it shall light the way to the center of this land. Hey, that rhymed. One way door, hold on. Out, but you know, it worked. Yeah, we're getting where we want to go eventually. These bats actually helped out twice, sort of. The large stone statue is friggin' hostility awaken it. Hostility awakens it. Further attacks will still its unrest. Whoa! What the hell? Oh boy. Yeah. Let's heal up. I, that might have been a mini boss. We can't see there though, which kind of sucks. We have a couple more glyph things we can run around and get to. I think we might do that now. There's at least one in the Temple of the Sun, I think. And the Inferno Caverns has one as well. Is it full? Yeah, that was full. Okay. Hey, that had a coin this time. Let's start with the Inferno Caverns, so I'm not even sure if it's the right cliff yet or not. Yeah, there's more than one. There's, I think, four of them. Yeah, too bad the scale sphere doesn't work for the, um... Lava. Although the Ice Cave does reduce it quite a bit, so that's still nice. And I'm gonna freaking get stuck down here again. Swimming physics in this game are a little weird at times. I'm just gonna get on the ground, walk to where sh where about I wanna be. Pause, just chill here for a second. And okay, we're good to go. This is 
is either going to be the right seal or the wrong seal. I'm not sure which. It's the wrong seal. Onward to the Endless Corridor. So where this is not the place we want to be, I don't think. Earlier. Hey, a seal and I believe that was the guild software going off. Either way, there's a shop here. The endless shop. That was well, whatever that is. Looks like a lint roller. It's sold out. Well, that was not particularly useful. So if I go to the correct menu, which always helps. To the Temple of the Sun. Alright, is that one right there? Yeah, hey, alright, let's do that. Let's go here. Okay. Yawn Mulberg slept well. Oh, are you the one who woke me? I see, then I'll let led you a hand, Yon. <laughs> Mulberg will help you, but still terribly sleepy. For now, here is some useful information. Wedget is another name for the god Horus. Horus is the god that the fifth children worshipped. It's an eye that supposedly sees everything from on high. See, Mulberg knows pretty much anything. Yon, sorry sleepy, going to sleep for a while, see you later. Really? Okay. Here. Freaking kangaroo rats hiding behind pillars. Hey, you better roll the other way, couple. Right, we have a hidden shop, apparently. And a glyph, but not the correct glyph. Let's see about this hidden shop. I'm actually gonna. Yeah. That glyph, which we don't have. Where else? That's what I want. I don't know if we have the right one or not. There is something potentially up here. We never really explored much of the surface anyway. I guess now is as good a time as any. Let's head on up here. This is where we got the Shellhorn way back in the first episode. As I'm walking into like every single enemy on screen now. Yep, a little awesome like that. Rapid water beyond this point, we think we should turn back. Let's always go to the top ledge. Where are we? Hey, money. We can break that pile up at any point, apparently. Leap of faith! Yeah, we didn't make it. Oh, wait a second. We have that seal! chest. It does, and we get the birth seal! Alright, now we got a whole bunch of other stuff that we need to freaking figure out where the hell the seals are for. I see a treasure chest. I don't know if I can get to the treasure chest at the moment. I have to break it, I guess. Let's use the axe. Well, that was a bunch of bats. Two more 
Which should do it. Got it. It's the cliff open now. Which is how we get in there. Anything over here? I'm gonna climb up still somewhere. Anything fighting around here? Nah, it doesn't look like it. Up the ladder we go. would work a lot better if we could climb up without getting hit. We could just kill the birds, I guess. That always works. I guess we're gonna make another leap of faith off the cliff. And hopefully this time we'll land in that treasure chest spot. This little sacred jewel orb jewel thing. Yeah, cool. More health and it filled us up, which is always good. Well, once again now, we have a bunch of freaking things to run around and get. We can do the Inferno Cavern now. It's the fact that I do believe we're about out of time, so next time, and let's play La Mulana. Rural. Rural. Yeah, not even like real word. Next time, we'll go back to that crest, here, sigil, seal thing here in the Inferno Caverns, open it up, see what it does, and then possibly track down some other ones, if I can remember where the heck half these things are. Feel free to comment, rate, and or subscribe, and have a great day.